This is no longer a coincidence. Look what they are doing to us. The 5th of August, 2023. I recorded two short videos. I recorded the first video at 12.53 and immediately after it. I recorded the second video at 13.23. Let's watch the short first video together. After I turned on the program in which I track storms, windy.com. On my computer, as usual, I first looked at the state of my country, Croatia, and then the other countries. The glowing lines that I already see on a regular basis have become a daily occurrence. Since I'm not an expert, storms like this on the map. Where there are only thunderstorms, I don't understand what kind of storms they are. Let's look at Canada again to see if the red hot lines are still in place. Not only those lines, but also huge circles. Natural phenomenon, or circles identical to each other. I think that this area has been like this every day, for the last week. I think in this part of the US, storms are a common occurrence. Correct me if I'm wrong. Let's look at Brazil again like in the last video, where I show this part of the map. The same red hot needles are still pointed towards this city. In Turkey, the same lines are still in the same place. Near Spain, these lines are constantly present. Now let's go to another video, where you can see them targeting certain cities that are later shown on the news. To me, this looks like an attempt to create a superstorm or tornado. What do you think? And, of course, she magically disappeared. Targeting the city of Timiso Ara in Romania. What would be the purpose of all this? Huge storms on the Adriatic coast, moving towards the interior of Croatia. Nothing from tourism this year, it doesn't matter anyway. Croatia lives only from tourism. She magically created herself again. Targeting this city? Perfect circles again? The center of each circle is always a city. What do you think? Coincidence or deliberate targeting of cities or some important infrastructure like farms and crops. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Share the video so that as many people as possible get to know the truth.
In the previous video, there was a massive circle. Traces are still visible. The hot spot is still visible in the very center. I would like to see the rest of the world. To see if there are also perfect lines and circles. I'm talking about the dark gray tinted parts of the map. Along these lines that target famous US cities. I would say that they don't mind that they are targeting their own people. I wish this was all a big misunderstanding. Because we're not weather experts after all. If there is a weather expert among you, now would be an opportunity to explain what these lines and circles are. Otherwise, we draw our own conclusions based on the behavior and policies of the world's most powerful governments and organizations. The current general state of the world. So we ordinary people would conclude that someone or something is using some kind of technology that, according to logic, can change the face of the globe itself. And with that forcibly changes the very social order of the human race. In my opinion, such organizations are too powerful for ordinary people to change things there, even if we discover their plans. The only and strongest weapon that ordinary people can use is faith in God. God is our most faithful ally since the beginning of the world. I speak only for those who have surrendered their lives to Jesus who is the way, the truth and the life, regardless of the current weather disasters. I think we are all witnessing drastic changes in the world, as if the world is like a pregnant woman at the beginning of labor. If you are in constant fear because of the current state of the world and at the same time you call yourself a Christian, then you are not yet saved, that is, born again. To become born again, you must live daily without sin, that is. You must accept Jesus as your Savior out loud with your own voice. You must strengthen your faith daily by reading the Bible and obey all Ten Commandments of God every day because the reward is peace in the soul, joy in knowledge of the truth that your purpose of existence is to serve the God of love, truth and justice. With a new birth you have a promise from God, who cannot lie that he will change you from the inside so that with a new birth, you will reject injustice and lies. When you are surrounded by daily sin, you will avoid it like you avoid a pothole in the middle of the road. Because everything written in the Bible has been fulfilled, and it is being fulfilled before your eyes. The victory is already is. Choose a side because there is still a little time left. He is returning. Check out these massive circles over Chinese cities and surrounding areas right in the places that have been in the news for some time now, where catastrophic flooding is happening where hundreds of people have lost their lives. Let someone dare to declare that this is a natural phenomenon. More massive perfect circles with the center of the metropolis. There are only two options, herb weapons or rare weather phenomena. Whatever it is, let's reduce this evil current influence with sincere prayers and not only reduce but destroy the influence of evil over our planet. Sincere prayers give birth to miracles. The greatest man in history, Jesus, had no servants, yet they called him master, had no degree, yet they called him teacher, had no medicines, yet they called him healer, he had no army, yet kings feared him, he won no military battles, yet he conquered the world, 
He did not live in a castle, yet they called him Lord. He ruled no nations, yet they called him King. He committed no crime, yet they crucified him. He was buried in a tomb, yet he lives today. Thank you all from the bottom of my heart for your support. I can't tell you how much it means to me when you subscribe and like my videos that I make especially for you.